Good evening, everyone. I wanted to welcome you to this group and thank you for being here. I am going to get ready with you live and talk about a few of my favorite products and why I love them. And then Courtney will go live after I finish. So if you have any questions about any of these products, feel free to comment below and I'll be glad to answer those while I'm getting ready and showing these awesome products. So I have a few here on my hand you can see I wanted to show you as well. These are a few of my top sellers and uh, they are berry. It's a really pretty dark color for fall. Fly Girl and Praline Rose. So just to show you what they look like on my skin tone. And I'm going to be wearing one of my favorite colors for fall today and that is Bella because it looks good on everyone. Like literally everyone looks good in Bella. So once I go through my full routine, I'm going to apply my lip sense at the end and show you how I do that. There is a little bit of a learning curve since it's not lipstick and it's not a lip stain or a gloss. It's just a lip color. It's its own category. I'm going to teach you how you can apply for best results for lasting color because we want you to love this product as much as we do. So that's why we are here to show you how to do that. So first things first, I have already applied my skincare regimen. If you don't follow me on social media, I have a YouTube channel. You can just search Caitlin Holly on YouTube and I have my morning and evening skincare routine up on my YouTube. And I talk about the importance of our skincare line for anti-aging. So a lot of people, um, some, maybe some of you, do not know that Cinegent, this company uh, that we're distributors for, has been around since 1999. So maybe you've heard of Lip Sense, maybe you've tried it, but don't know a lot about it or the company, and we've actually been around since 99. But the last year, we've taken off and exploded since social media has taken off and so it's been really fun to try all of these products and I know I've switched over and used all of our products exclusively now because I've, I'm obsessed. Um, if you love Lip Sense, you're going to fall in love with all of our products and so I'm going to show you which ones I use and why I love them. So I've done my skincare already and washed my hands and I have applied our primer so I have to talk about this stuff because it's one of my favorite products. It's called Silk Pore and Wrinkle Minimizer. So it not only fills in fine lines and wrinkles and minimizes pores, but it actually prepares your face for your foundation. So it doubles as a primer and I always use it about 15 minutes before I apply my foundation and get ready for the day. I will just press it into my pores, like especially my T-zone. And it also prepares my face for my foundation and smooths out my skin. So I have already applied my silk. So next I'm going to do eye illuminator. So what is our eye illuminator? It is an eye cream. So it protects the thin skin under our eyes, um, which is prone to wrinkle and stretch and cause crow's feet. So it protects and moisturizes that sensitive skin, but it has our highlighter built in called Pearlizer. So it illuminates, brightens, and widens the eye and makes us look more awake. So um, it's one of my top sellers and probably my favorite product outside of Lip Sense. Um, I love our eye illuminator. So I'm gonna show you the difference. So no makeup on my face, no concealer yet. I haven't put my foundation on, okay? So this is my natural no makeup face, okay? So I'm gonna put just a little bit of eye illuminator under my eye and it's going to cover dark circles, moisturize that thin skin, and then it's also going to make me look more awake, which I need because I work long hours, right? I mean, we deserve to look awake. I know I wish I'd had this when I worked night shifts because it just instantly wakens you up. So look at how much wider this eye looks compared to this one. So that's with only our eye illuminator. 
All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a little eye illuminator under my other eye. So I do that as a part of my skincare routine, whether or not I'm wearing makeup because it's going to protect that sensitive skin. That is the thinnest skin on our bodies is that under eye area. So you wanna protect that and our eye cream with highlighter does just that. So next I'm going to start with a little concealer. So another thing that is so awesome about our makeup is that it's so versatile. Um, you can even use lip scents or lip color on uh, your eyes as eyeshadow. You can use it as liner, as blush, and um, we have long lasting eyeshadow as well. And I use it as eyeliner, as concealer, and I prime my eyelids with it, and I use it as eye color. So, so many uses for this stuff. And I use candlelight as concealer. So I'm gonna do a little bit, just wherever I have a blemish or want to cover up any kind of redness, discoloration. So um, normally I just do it under my eyes because that's where I would use concealer. So that's candlelight shadow sense. I love it, obsessed with it. And I like to use my fingers for this part because the warmth just helps to work in the shadow sense really well and that is what I use for concealer. So that's candlelight shadow scents. So it just evens out my skin tone really well. And we do have a concealer. We have uh, new, new shades of concealer as well that just came out. Um, I just have our white concealer. I haven't gotten the new shades yet. Um, but I have a warm undertone, so I like to use the candlelight as concealer for that reason. But you can use our um, concealer concealer. Um, I use it for highlighting. So that is just candlelight concealer under my eyes. And that's eyeshadow. It's crazy. Okay, so next I'm going to show you one of my other favorite products, which is our Color Correcting Tinted Moisturizer. So... When I don't wear full foundation, I will just apply our tinted moisturizer because it's sheer, yet it's full coverage, um, but it's just not as much hassle and doesn't take as much time as applying foundation. So, super easy to use. It's also color correcting, so you'll see here in a second when I apply it, it's gonna cover up like discoloration, like this redness right here I have. It's gonna cover all that, so it's color correcting. Um, it also has our Cineplex Complex in it. So you'll hear me talk more about that um, as I'm getting ready. But basically, our Cineplex Complex is in all of our products. It's our patented anti-aging formula. So it's in our skincare and it's in all of our makeup. And it's going to regenerate uh, new skin cells 23 times faster. So it helps you look younger and regenerates those skin cells and makes you know your skin look amazing. So that's in our makeup, it's in our tinted moisturizer. So um, I love that. I wear medium and it also comes in light. So I just usually use one pump. And um, like I said, when I don't wear foundation, this is all I wear because it's full coverage. And especially like when I'm outside going to the beach or going to the lake, it's got my sun protection in it as well. So it has a sun shield equivalent to SPF 15, which is awesome. So I'm getting my sun protection in as well. So just do one pump and I'll show you how it covers so well redness. and just corrects any discoloration. It's cream to powder. All of our products are actually cream to powder, even our blush, eyeshadow. So I just use a Real Techniques um, stippling brush because it works in the product really well, but you can even use your fingers or any brushes that you want. So, That is just 
our color correcting tint and moisturizer. So it's giving me some coverage, correcting that redness that I pointed out. See, it was right in here. I love our tint moisturizer. Okay, so I wanted to show you that first, but I'm going to also apply foundation. So, our foundation is also anti-aging, has our Cineplex Complex in it, and it's cream to powder, and adjust up to three shades, which is really nice because with the changing of seasons, you don't have to go pick out a new shade, buy a new foundation, and it has a no waste pump. So you can see my foundation. I've been using this bottle since February and I'm not even halfway, right about there. So I'm, I've used maybe 30 to 40% of my bottle. It lasts forever because there's an airless no waste pump that literally pushes your product, your foundation up. Um, so you're not wasting any and you're getting the most bang for your buck. So you can see it's in all of our products. Here's my tint and moisturizer that I've also been using since February. So it lasts forever. And like I said, just one pump. Um, and I like to add in our powder for a more airbrush finish. Even though our products are all cream to powder and full coverage, I do like just to have a little bit more of a airbrush finish. So you can definitely do that or do just the foundation. So I'm just going to start in the middle of my face and work my way out. So this is our anti-aging foundation. And I got a little bit on my lips. I wear the shade Suede, but we have tons of different shades to choose from. But like I said, it does adjust up to three shades, which is so nice. So if you're not sure what shade you wear, we can help you at least get really close and it will adjust, which is great. So cream to powder finish. And like I said, I just use a Real Techniques stippling brush because it works in the product really well, but you can even use your fingers. Like you don't have to have a bunch of products. You don't have to be an esthetician or a cosmo cosmetologist, can't talk now, to use these products. They're so easy to apply. Like if I'm in a hurry, if I have like five minutes to get ready, I will literally just use my fingers and go fast. So that is our foundation. You can see it's powder finish, so really pretty. and blend so well. So that is suede in our anti-aging foundation. Okay, next I'm going to do some contouring and highlighting with eyeshadow. So like I mentioned, our products are so versatile and have multi-usage. So Mocha Java Shimmer, for example, is one of my favorite eye shadows. It's going to last all day and is waterproof. It's not going to smudge off. I usually just put it in the outer corners of my eyes, but then I use it for contouring. So just anywhere I want the, I want to pop, I just apply. And that's Mocha Java Shimmer. It's a pretty neutral brown. Okay. So, and then I'm just going to work that in for a little bit of contour. And then I will go back and do a little highlighting. So, this is totally option. This is just what I like to use. 
because it's so easy. Like I was always, I'm not a makeup artist. Um, I watch YouTube videos and I'm self-taught. So, you know, I was always intimidated by all of the highlighting and contouring that I saw. And I really didn't know where to start. These products have honestly built my confidence and made it fun. Like I actually enjoy contouring and highlighting and I've never done this ever. I never even wore lipstick until nine months ago until lip since. So I like to do just a little bit of contouring on my neck and forehead and then I'll blend in my eye color. So you saw me apply it straight from the wand. You can use your fingers and you can use a brush and just blend that in really well. So this is Mocha Java Shimmer Shadow Sense, our long lasting eyeshadow. All of our products our, are um, waterproof, long lasting, smudge proof, vegan, non-GMO, gluten free, wax free, lead free, just like lip scents. So, in case you're just familiar with just the lip scents, all of our products are the same. Just as amazing. And I'm going to go back in with a little bit of sandstone pearl shimmer on the inside corners. I like to use it for a added pop. So Mocha Java shimmer on the outside edges and then sandstone pearl shimmer on the inside. So these are my go-to shadow colors for every day and like I said the Mocha Java shimmer I also used as contouring. Okay so I'm gonna let that set a little bit. Um, another awesome thing about our products is um, they're foolproof. So my eyeshadow is going to set in a minute or two, but until then I have a little wiggle room to blend it and get it to look like I want it. So it's super easy to work with. I'm just going to blend that in. But we have matte eye colors as well. I just do like the um, shimmer. I prefer matte lip colors and then a little bit of shimmer on my eyes. So I just blend that in. See, it gives a little bit of pop by doing the sandstone pearl shimmer on the inner corners of my eyes and then the mocha java shimmer on the outer edges. So I love our shadows because they layer so well and they're so easy to blend. So that's it. No priming needed. My eye color is going to last 24 hours or until I take it off. So next I'm going to do a little bit of onyx shadow scents. This is our eyeshadow, but I use it as liner. So I'm going to show you. You can apply it straight from the wand. Um, I know my last YouTube video, I did um, no brushes on any of these products and showed you how I do that. But um, I think it is a little easier if you have a little angled brush if you want a winged eye. Um, you could definitely easily do a smudged eye with onyx. So I'm going to do this in my mirror. So I like to do just a little winged eye like that. Look how pretty that is. That's eyeshadow, y'all. And um, I love it as eyeliner. And then I'll do the other eye and then finish up with some blush and lip scents.
And that's usually all I do, just a simple winged eye. Okay, so that is Onyx, our black shadow, shadow scents. And next I'm going to do, oh, I forgot to highlight. Let me do a little bit of highlighting, show you how easy it is. So I like to blend our white concealer with a little bit of foundation. So I can show you how easy it is to do that. So I usually do like half a pump of foundation and then a little bit of white concealer. Blend that in. But if you're really fair, if you have a lighter skin tone, you can definitely just use our white concealer as highlighter. And like I said, we have new, brand new shades of concealer that I can't wait to try. Okay, so a little bit of highlight. Do you like T-Zone? Under my cheekbones and under my eyes. It's so easy to do. Like I said, I used to never highlight or contour ever because I just thought it was too difficult. But I literally will just do like a V shape under my eyes and then blend that in with my brush, T-zone, center of the forehead, because remember I've contoured kind of like in a three, starting from my forehead, in the shape of a three. That's where my contour is. So I'm just gonna highlight in the areas that I haven't. Contoured, and then I will set that and bake that with a little bit of our natural powder. So this is great setting powder, great for baking. Let me get a different brush. So I just usually dump a little bit onto my brush or you can use a sponge. And it's so easy to set that highlight. And I just leave that powder for a few minutes. So I'll go on and do my blush. So that's just our natural powder. And it's just gonna help make that highlight and airbrush finish and set it really well. So that's just called baking. Learn that from YouTube. So see, it's really easy to get these looks. It doesn't take a lot of time. Okay. So that's my highlighting and baking, and I'm gonna let that set for a minute. Okay, our blush, my favorite is Toasted Rose, and it is liquid blush, and a little bit goes such a long way. I do just like a little tiny, tiny dot on each cheekbone. And I never used liquid blush until our blush as well and it's so easy to use like I'll just dab it in and it dries cream to powder I love toasted rose so pretty okay so that's blush and then I can go ahead and do some mascara so our mascara is waterproof and I use the lash builder. So this is called under Sense, and it lengthens and builds the lashes without extensions, without fibers. It's just like a gray primer, a gray mascara that you apply first and then you go back with the waterproof mascara. So this is called Lash Scents with Under Scents. And I'm obsessed with it. So if you like the look of long lashes, but don't want to wear fake lashes or get extensions or anything, 
our lash sense is really good. So I'm gonna let that sit for a minute, then go back with the lash sense, and I'm going to just dust off the excess powder that I baked with. Okay, my face is set. It's gonna last all day. Not gonna smudge off or sweat off. Okay, and then I can go back with our black waterproof mascara. And I am a mascara junkie. I have used just about every kind there is. And this is definitely my favorite because it doesn't, you know, sweat off, doesn't come off when you cry, you don't have to reapply it, and it's easy to remove with our Foops remover. So, a lot of people ask me, you know, well, how do you take off your lip scents and how do you remove your makeup if it lasts all day and if it's waterproof and, you know, and we have removers. So our Oops Remover removes your lip scents, fixes mistakes, and then removes your color at the end of the day. And then our Foops Remover removes all of our makeup, all of our face products. So at the end of the day, I'll just apply our Foops Remover and all my makeup will, will literally just melt off. So easy. So I don't always apply the under sense builder on my bottom lashes. I'm just gonna do a little black lash sense. And if you have naturally long lashes and don't want the builder, you can definitely just get the waterproof mascara without the builder. But most people want the builder. It's one of my top sellers. So I am ready for my lip color. So excited to show y'all how to apply lip scents and how amazing it is. It's our wow product. It's our top selling product. But like I said, it's just where the addiction starts because as amazing as lip scents is, all of our makeup and skincare is even more amazing. So, applying lip scents. All right, so full face done except for my lips and I'm going to be applying Bella, which is a neutral matte color that looks good on everybody. So, first thing you wanna shake your color up really well, about 30, 60 seconds. And what this does is it mixes up the alcohol delivery system with your color. So, Lip Sense is 98% natural, 2% science. And what that means is the 2% science is just cosmetic grade alcohol. And it's just gonna deliver the color to your lips, the color will bond to your lips, and then the alcohol evaporates. So it doesn't actually stay on your lips. It just delivers the color. So it's not a lip stain or a lipstick, it's not drying. And you do three thin layers, one direction. So think like a dry erase marker on a dry erase board. So you can see I wipe off the excess. So my wand looks dry. A Little bit goes such a long way. One tube will last four times as long as lipstick. So it lasts forever. One tube would last you six months if you wore it every day. So you're actually saving money in the long run because you're not eating and drinking your lipstick off. It's actually going to stay on your lips and then last forever um, one tube. And then the alcohol also keeps bacteria out of your tube since it lasts so many months. So that's nice. Okay, so one direction. I'm going to show you how I apply it. 
and then I'm gonna let dry about 30 to 60 seconds in between each layer. Okay, and then I'm going to seal three layers with my gloss, okay? And that just seals in my color, moisturizes my lips, and makes sure that it lasts 18 hours. So, that's why you do the gloss and the lip color. All right, so this is Bella, okay? I'm gonna apply. Okay, layer one. <laughs> Let that dry really well. Okay. Now do layer number two. Okay. Let that dry. <laughs> and then do layer number three. Let that dry. See how pretty that is? Okay, now I seal it in with my gloss. See how it didn't come off on my wand? Okay. So that is Bella with Glossy Gloss. So when I want a more matte finish, since this is a matte color, I really like it with matte gloss as well. So you don't have that glossy shine. I usually just do a thin layer of glossy first, let that set in, and then I'll go back and do our matte gloss. Um, and I'll only need to apply that once or twice throughout the day. No reapplying my color. Um, and so it's going to last all day. It's not going to come off on my cup or my husband. So I'm going to show you. There's only gloss coming off, rubbing off. How awesome is that? I'm obsessed. So that's Bella. So that is available to order if you want to try this one. 
like I said, it's my favorite for fall right now. This looks good on everybody and it's so pretty for this time of year. So, okay, we're gonna keep this party going and go live and do a few posts and feel free to ask any questions and we'll be glad to answer those and hope y'all are having a good time.